as you complete the e-tivities as part of an online unit, there's actually a way that you can manage what you're doing so that it becomes less of a challenge and you actually have all the information that you need um, at one time. So the way to do that is actually to log into two different internet browsers at the same time, meaning that you can have the e-tivity on one browser and then you can have all your resources accessible on another browser. So it means that you don't have to keep on going backs and forwards, you can actually operate off the two windows at the same time. I'm going to do this by using uh, the Firefox internet browser and the Safari internet browser. So this one here is Firefox and this one here is Safari because I'm a Mac user. If you're a Windows user, you're probably going to be using Internet Explorer and something like Chrome. If you don't have a second browser on your computer at the moment, you can download them um, for free. Um, I would recommend that you download Firefox. So Firefox is all one word um, and just follow the, the links that are on their, their homepage. So I'm going to open up Firefox first of all and then I'm going to open up Safari and you'll see that I've minimized or I've, I've resized the windows um, so they actually uh, sit next door to each other. And I'm just going to make sure that I'm at the Leo homepage for everything. Okay, so on the left hand side is Firefox and on the right hand side is um, Safari and I'm going to be logging in with my normal details. Now this is the way that, that I do it, so two different, two different browsers logging at the same time and it means that I can access the same information um, at the same time which just makes life a little bit easier. So the first thing I'm going to do <clears throat> is give myself student access so it looks the same as it does on your screen. Okay, so I'm now looking at Leo at the same time on two different screens um, through a student view, so it should look similar to um, what you can see. I'm actually going to access the eTivity itself on the left-hand screen, which is the Firefox one. So I'm going to go into week one, and I'm going to scroll down to the eTivity section, and I'm going to click on the eTivity one link. And then on the right-hand side, I'm going to go to week one, and I'm going to keep that window open. So I'm going to keep the module um, window open and that's showing me um, some of the resources that I need. As I go through, um, as we go through the semester, those resources um, will become um, maybe a little bit more uh, complex than they are this week and there certainly will be a lot of them. So as I go into um, the eTivity, it's going to ask me a couple of questions and I want to make sure that making my life easier, I've actually got that resource on the right-hand side. So I think you'll find that the first one is actually the unit outline. So what I can do here is it says, um, have you read the unit outline? So what I could actually do is if I just pop out of week one on the right-hand side, and um, I know that from my investigations of the unit, the e-unit outline is in the unit information folder. Uh, I'll just make that so that see it and I can now access the unit outline and on the left hand side I can complete that particular question so yes I've read the unit outline and I'm going to submit that continue and the next one is saying um, have I read uh, the salmon um, reading so I'm going to close my unit outline and I know that my salmon reading is in my week one module I'm going to go into that and then I can actually click on the salmon reading while I've also got my eTivity um, open on the left hand side. So it's, that's pretty much the process, so it's just having two browsers open, you can log in using the same details at the same time and it will allow you to keep your, um, to keep your resources open and also the eTivity. Now some of you might even be operating from two screens, which, which as I do, I have two screens next door to each other so I can have them on different screens but you don't need that. You just need one screen, two browsers, log in twice, um, and it should make life a little bit easier for you.